international fixtures. And we're going to start out right at home in CONCACAF, the U.S. against Mexico in Columbus. Now, I'm a little bit disappointed because this is game one of the hex, and I feel like that takes the edge off of it. And maybe the least important thing about this game, Phil, is the three points. Tell me why I'm wrong. Well, the most important thing right now is it's going to come three days after a certain election that is going to draw even more focus. And I wouldn't be surprised if the Mexican team comes out even a little bit more fired up. Uh, as far as the United States team, in all honesty, this is perfect time because there's going to be nine other matches that will follow regardless of what happens here. If it's great, it's a great launch. If they fall short and it's not another dos acero like they've had a history of it in Columbus, they'll have plenty of time to bounce back. Although next week we have that match on the road at Costa Rica, which is also going to be kind of difficult. So you might think it's ho-hum, but if they start the uh, hex at 0-2, right. mm. yeah, they've got to come out the traps flying. They just right. do, and they've got some injuries, George. So, yeah, it is, sure. so it is massive for you, for you guys. I think I, it's, I think it's a, a massive game, but it's, it's a, a hugely massive opportunity. Important, yeah, and a great opportunity for Klinsman to get going right from the get-go against a good quality team because these Mexicans play quick, sharp, insightful, smart football for me. And I, I would go as far as to say on pure talent, Phil, they may just edge the United States. Yeah. I think if 